Drone technology deployed in some of Zanzibar's inaccessible areas to fight against malaria. The drones spray mosquito-infested rice fields, typical breeding grounds for malaria mosquitoes, with Aquatin AMF, a non-toxic colorless solution which creates a thin film on the water surface killing the malaria pupae and larvae. As you can see, the way the paddies look like, it's very difficult to just walk through the paddies and apply the chemical. So you want to have something that can just spray it on the water surface, it spreads, does its job, and that is it. Such fields, stagnant pools of water, and other vegetation land use are typical breeding grounds for the Anopheles mosquito, the type that transmits malaria, which the United Nations says kills a young child every minute and causes 75% of all under five deaths. Sub-Sahara Africa accounted for 90% of malaria deaths around the world, the WHO said. In Tanzania, 70,000 people die annually from the mosquito-transmitted disease. The researchers intend to use the results of this experiment to further combat the disease across the continent. In the future, if this goes well and we get good results from this trial, that we may be uh, using the same technology in many other parts of Africa where they have irrigated agriculture and malaria problems. If not, that we may in some cases actually be contributing to the elimination of malaria in a specific country. The researchers say they choose Zanzibar for the trials because of its progressive laws towards the use of drones. Other countries in Africa have deployed drones in the fight against malaria. Malawi, for example, has used drones to map mosquito breeding sites, but the researchers in Zanzibar say spraying aquatine takes the malaria fight to the next level.